Hello, I welcome you all to this another interesting screencast. We are going to be solving this engineering mechanics a problem and it reads uh, a bicycle travels along a straight road where its velocity is described by the velocity position graph. Construct the acceleration a position graph for the same same interval. All right, solution. So what we've been given, what has been given to us is uh, this particular function, which is velocity, which is a function of uh, position. All right. We know that uh, uh, velocity, okay, is equal to uh, ds over dt, and the, our acceleration is equal to dv over dt, and the two can be re uh, related by making dt subject of the formula. We have dt is equal to ds over v and we have dt in the other end there is equal to dv over a and we can equate the two right then we'll have ds over d over v which is equal to dv over a okay and then we know that because we know that this can also be written as dv Okay, over ds is equal to, as dv over ds is equal to a over v. And therefore, our a is going to be equal to uh, the velocity times dv over ds. Okay. So, we have this relationship, right? Where acceleration is equal to velocity times dv ds, right? And we have there v is equal to 0 0.25 s. Okay. Can I wrap this? Can I wrap this? I just wanted to come to this. I didn't just want to write this directly. All right. So in my videos to come, I'll just be writing this relationship directly, right? Is that fine? So there we go. So we know that this is the case here and our velocity is equal to 0 0.25 s and our dv ds will give us this is s please this is s it looks like a 5 okay it is going to give us this is s is s here so if we were to find the derivative of 0.25 s what does it give us just gives us a 0.25 right you agree right okay therefore our acceleration is going to be equal to v which is the velocity so it is 0 0.25 you agree s this is s times this the VDS which we found is what? 0 0.25, right? Okay, and if we are to multiply the two by S, we get a 0 0.0625S. All right. Okay, so let's now find the value of acceleration at s is equal to 40 meters so a of 40 is going to be equal to 0 0.0625 times 40 what does this give us times 40 it gives us a 2.5 all right so we also get a linear function right do we mm -hmm. we get a linear function so let's plot this let's plot this something like so something like so okay so we have acceleration there in meters per second squared and we have displacement in meters there and we have 40 there like so 
okay so our acceleration will be just a little bit steeper than uh, this one the slope is a little bit uh, uh, bigger right is it no it isn't the slope is smaller all right this is the maximum value we get whereas the other one we get a 10 so we get something like this here it is even the slope is lower in the acceleration right this is 2.5 like so okay so if we are to plot this this is 40 here something like this so i just wanted to get the point in advance something like this okay yeah so this is going to be our uh this is going to be our acceleration and this line here is a is equal to zero point zero six two five s this is s this is letter s all right okay yeah that's about it you know we are done i hope videos are uh, interesting direct and uh, clear uh, please continue subscribing and liking my videos. Bye-bye and see you in my next uh, screencast.